together again. The song said something good is going to happen. Tell your neighbor something good is going to happen. If you have a handkerchief, you can bring it out. We want to celebrate and bless the name of the Lord. Because something good is about to happen. Say amen. Amen. Something good is about to happen. Something good is about to happen. I've got a feeling. I've just got a feeling that something good is about to happen. I, I, I just don't know why. But my eyes, my heart, my body is ready for something good. Because something good is about to happen. Siri na shira la wabula tendereza. When you are expecting something good, your body must prove it. But the way some people are dancing, as if you are waiting for only bad news. I know. No matter what the doctors told you, the blood and the blood of Jesus has made you whole. Amen. Amen. So I just want you to dance as if really something good is, has, is happening, is about to happen.
And verses 1. Father, we give you praise. We thank you for the joy of the Lord is our strength. We thank you for the spirit of joy you have given in our lives. We are not happy because everything is okay. But we are happy because we have the Holy Spirit. And the fruit of the Spirit is joy. So we are happy because we have the Spirit of God in us. Holy Spirit, take over in each and everything. In the name of Jesus. The Bible says when the day of Pentecost came, they were all together in one place. There is a day that comes when people are together. On the day of Pentecost, it so happened that people were together. It so happening that people were together. It is so happening that on the day of fellowship, we are together again. Those who come in the first service, second service, and third service. And when they were together, on the day of Pentecost, something good happened. Praise the name of the Lord. Something good happened when they were together on the day of Pentecost. Even today, as we are together, something good has already begun to take place in our lives. <laughs> Verses 2. Suddenly, tell your neighbor, suddenly, 
You know the word suddenly? Unexpectedly. Without warning. You know, have you ever seen rain coming when there are no crowds? It doesn't give a warning. Most of you, you know when it's about rain, you know if it comes from that end, it will rain. If it comes from that side, no, it will not come near here. But there is a kind of rain that takes you by surprise. You don't see where it's coming from, but it just come down. So I want to speak to you. There is something that you don't expect that it's going to suddenly to happen in your life. You don't know where it is coming from. But it's going to fall upon you. And it is a good thing. Woo. I receive it. <laughs> Hallelujah. Suddenly a sound like the blowing of a violent wind came from heaven and filled the whole house where they were sitting. Three. They saw what seemed to be Tanks of fire that separated and came to rest on each of them. All of them were filled with the Holy Spirit. I want you to say all of them. Not some, but all of them. Today is not for some people, but all of us. The moment you came in, something is going to happen to you. All of them. And they began to speak in other tongues as the Spirit enabled them. Uh-huh. Now, they were staying in Jerusalem, God-fearing Jews from every nation under heaven. When they heard this sound, a crowd came together in bewilderment because each one heard them speaking in his own language. Listen. Listen. The people who had visited, who were around that city, they saw these people who were together speaking different languages. But these tongues, these other tribes, they had these people speaking one of their tribes, their languages. You are about to understand it. Uh -huh. After they amazed, they asked, and, and not all these men who are speaking Galileans, then how is it that each of us hears them in his own native language? Now these are the nations that were there. These are the languages that were there. That is, you know, the Parthians, Medes, and the Aramites. Residents of Mesopotamia, Judea, and Cappadocia, Pontus and Asia, Pigia and Pamphylia, Egypt and the parts of Libya near Slim, visitors from Rome, both Jews and converts to Judaism. Cretans and Arabs, we hear them declaring the wonders of God in our own tongues. 
Katonda nga yogera ne basanguze nimi zaabwe Amazed and perplexed they asked one another what does this mean Bonna ne beewunya ne ba ne ba busa busa ne bagamba anti amakuru gacho chichino Mukama yeba zibwe Praise the Lord Amawanga mukana byolukalala You have seen the number of nations Ne buli kwanga lyagenda okulira nga waliyo omuntu ayogera olulimi lwaabwe But every nation had someone speak their language Mukama yeba zibwe Praise the Lord Orwale ndo wano kutegeza I'm here to tell you O moyo mutukuvu yamaze dokuka mu chifochi The spirit of the Lord has already descended in this place And name is the face ikenda kuchuka Our languages are going to change right now Mchukudira Can I repeat that? Your language is going to change. You are going to speak a new language. Praise the Lord. I said, Praise the Lord. Today. The spirit of the Lord is in this place. To change the way that you speak. You know that rich men have their language? The rich have also a different language. And the poor also have a different language. And when you find the poor having a conversation, did you get a matchbox? Did you buy <laughs> some bananas? I don't know how much is the salt. <laughs> Are you going to town? Do you have some money with you? You know I'm going to walk. I think I'll board from Chiwunya there. That is the language for the poor. They have their language. But even the rich have their language. And when you find them conversing, do you have at least a million shilling? What are you using it for? You know, I want to take my wife out. But do you have a million, please? Yeah, I had some for, but let me give you two. That is the language for the rich. The rich have their language. Today, who are speaking the language of the poor? God is changing you. You are going to speak. As the rich speak, and the rich will be amazed and surprised. Is that the poor person we need? How is he able to speak our language? God raises the poor from the dust. And sits them with the kings. God is going to raise you right from the dust. He is going to sit you at a place. Where the rich sit, I declare that upon your life in Jesus' name. You who used to go to the butcher. And the butcher knows that you ask for a quarter. And when you get there, I will tell you you want a quarter as usual. Tell me my language has changed. Hey, hey. My language has changed. Today I'm speaking a different language. Give me three kilograms that my children will enjoy. Bible the Bible told us to cast off the nakano. We can read it together. Amazed and perplexed. Never will you kill it and you? To cast off me, aha. Never will you kill it. What is why you say ma? What kashi? Eh? Ah ah. What messi anga? Nini na indereya? They asked one another, What does this mean? You tell them God had mercy on me. God had mercy on me. What is this? And he lifted me from the poor. And he brought me to a new level. Woo! 
Singles have their languages. Now singles, this is what you do. You find where there is commando and you land there. You find singles of such places waiting for chapatis, food along the streets, that's where they land during the evening. Even in the night, they are dreaming about that song. Pirawa wa bidichama wano. Those are singles. Marriages have got another language. What are you taking for your wife? You buy a bunch of banana. Now, how can a single buy a bunch of banana? You buy matoke, you buy meat. You are talking about family. Katonda is changing your life from being single to a language of the marriage. I'm here to declare to you. A lady who is ready to be married you go out and check out for the wedding gowns God is bringing your miracle praise the Lord these people saw so and heard everyone whose language being spoken you, you have spent years in marriage without a child Parents have their language. Your parents have their language. Your parents have their language. Your parents have their language. Touch your womb right now. Say my womb has many children. Isaiah 54 says Sing you barren woman For your children are many Even beyond those who are breastfeeding Speak to your womb That my womb has many children When you go back home Shop for your child Shop for your children When they ask you Just tell them my language has changed. Praise the Lord. The Bible has showed us many languages that were spoken. Those who bought airplanes have their languages too. They talk about tickets. How much is a ticket? How do, get, how do you get a visa? When they come back, they welcome them back from the overseas. They have, they have these other people have their language too. They cross the rivers and lakes. I, I cross a river called Katonga. I'm not cross the river Nile. I come from Jinja. God bless you. One man, when I had gone to Busoga, one man told me, I leave us the Busoga. We are always in Italy. We are always in Italy. Where is your friend? He says he's in Italy. <laughs> Hallelujah. May God change your language and you start speaking about other nations in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. You men and women who are here, God is seeing great women and great men among you. Some of you are always speaking about failing. 
And that is what you also tell your children. My children, don't you know your problems? Why do you tell children about your problems and sorrow? Please, people, don't take a lot of sugar. You must know. When the children ask you for pocket money, you tell them, please get to know your sorrow. And you start speaking another language. Stop cursing yourself. Stop cursing yourself. I, I, I'm so sorrowful. I am so troubled. I have things coming again after me. Why do you always declare that upon yourself? What is coming against you? I have things after me that came from our clan. I want to tell you today. I have things that are after me. I have things that are after me. I always try to escape them, but they're always following me. I also have my clans, things that are coming after me. And they come from our grand grandfathers. Our forefathers did something bad. They are things that are following us each and every day. My, my grand Ibrahim, Abraham. the faith of Abraham is following me every day. Woo. I have things after me. <laughs> David said, Goodness and mercy follow me always. Come and follow me. This is goodness. And I'm the greatest. Come follow me each and every day. Come follow me each and every day. Let whatever follows you be good to you. May God change your language and start having good things that are following you. <laughs> when you get your place of work and they refuse to employ you, just say, I have something following me. Uh -uh. Don't say something is following me bad. Oh, I carry the blessing of God. The blessing found that I wasn't fit for this job. <laughs> the blessing of God is taking me to another level. Change the way you speak. When you go to the embassy and they deny you the visa, don't say who's bewitching me. Yes, the blessing of God is upon me. God has seen it wasn't yet my time. If the Rwandese have refused to give me their visa, let me get the one for Europe. Change the way you speak. Say goodness and mercy. He's with me. They follow me. Hallelujah. Give God a mighty hand up of praise. Some of you here, God is going to change the way you speak. People will find you and hear you say, Praise the Lord. Kasifa. <laughs> What are you saying? What are you talking about? They may come looking out for a Muslim. You tell them I'm no longer Muslim, but Jesus reigns in my life. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! They may call you and think that a Muslim. Muhammad, you come close. You come close. You know these things. They are for Jamaz. They are not for Kafilus. As you are Muhammad, now if you don't take these things, Assalamu alaikum. I tell them, praise the Lord. They say, What's the problem? Oh, my language has already changed. When God comes, He changes the language. 
Mukama Yevas. Praise the Lord. I pray that God will change what you speak. May God change what was known about you. May God change your failing. May God save you and enrich you. May God give you everything good. Praise the Lord. The Kayanja will sing before you. I took some, I finished P7 without putting on shoes. In my feet, I had tenants in my feet. Next morning, I had a After chasing one tenant, another one comes in books and room. Because I had tenants, my way of walking had changed. When you step on the stones, they disagree with your tenants. I was disturbed with jiggers. At that time, there is a, a, a footballer who was called Sekatawa. Sekatawa. He was a great man in express. He used to walk in that good way, boosting. In the village, I was called Sekatawa. Because diggers were disturbing men, I had to change the way of walking. I was not Sekatawa, but the diggers had given me a new walk. But when Jesus came to me, today I can put it on my shoes. <laughs> Hallelujah. Today I walk as Kayanja. <laughs> Hallelujah, Jesus. Praise the Lord. When you welcome Jesus, he changes your story. The one you see, the interpreter myself, I served demons four times and years. <laughs> I could even change languages. <laughs> but a young man like me. And people would come <laughs> and bow to me to serve them. <laughs> I could sit in the sun and people would be. But when I accepted Jesus, today I'm not a great man. I'm about to marry in Jesus' name. I receive it. Praise the Lord. Jesus can change your story totally. When the Spirit of God descended, He spoke new tongues. Today you are going to speak new things in your life in Jesus' name. You start right now. Tell your neighbor, I am rich. Woo. I tell your neighbor I packed somewhere. Now take your poverty, me. I'm no longer part of you. Ah, I'm no longer Muslim. I'm born again. Praise the Lord. Verse 44. Verse 44. Let's go there quickly. To okay. All the believers were together and had everything in common. They were together and had things in common. Praise the Lord. You are rich, I'm also rich. I am strong, you are also strong. You speak in tongues, I do. You fear the Lord, I also fear the Lord. In your faith, I also have faith. May God change your life and it match with others in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. God is rich in mercy. Tell your neighbor, God is rich in mercy. 
we used to jump and skip those trenches. In our village, we had a river called Busale. They will tell you, but be careful when it comes to that river Busale. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Today I don't jump over streams, but I fly over in Jesus' name. God can change your story and you be totally different. When I started preaching the gospel, the woman who knew me said that boy cannot preach the gospel. And the time she saw me doing it, she said, God is so powerful. You are here despising yourself, but you were a great evangelist in Jesus' name. You are a great man of God. You are a great businesswoman. No sorrow, no misfortune, no problem will remain in your life. God is changing your language in Jesus' name. Come and hear me. Say amen. Bible the Bible says this is the grace that said Jesus. He who was poor, rich, the one who was rich became poor that we may become rich. <laughs> I'm rich not because I'm very wise. It is the grace of God because Jesus chose to become poor so that I may become rich. I used to have some problems. Every year I was admitted. I would follow sick around June and July. And they would tell me I am sick about Jesus. So but when I came to Jesus, his body healed all my diseases. And by his stripes, my diseases were healed. I don't fall sick. Praise the Lord. Some of you are well off. Me, I used to sleep and something came and attacked me. You'd want to speak and fail to speak. You wanted to open your mouth, but still you failed. What I, I chose, I said, I will sleep with my brother. When it, when it comes, I will tell him it has come now. When I was there and it came, I wanted to tell him that something is attacking me. But I failed because I was almost palatic. But I could hear him snoring. And then I said, doesn't he hear what is happening? Something tormented me until it left. Then I said, I'll have a torch with me. When it comes, I'll put on the torch. When I saw the darkness come, then I pulled out my torch. I wanted to pull out my torch. But my hand could not do so. And it tormented me still. I could not sleep even in the night. But when I accepted Jesus, then he drove away everything that was upon me. Today I sleep until I say, please wake up. I have, please, I sleep. Good, I have some good sleep. I already set an alarm to help me wake up. But those days I had my natural alarm. Yes, it's only Jesus who can change everything about you and you'll be different. Friend, in Jesus' name, give God a mighty hand clap of praise. Right now, we are going to pray. I want to pray for some people. Banamukisa, those who are blessed. Today, there are people who are blessed. Church in Baburire. Should I tell you, church, there are some people who are blessed that I'm going to pray for. 
Those who say I've not been born again But today I want to be born again When you accept Jesus I'm going to pray a blessing over you And your family will be amazed I want to pray for you wherever you are you want me to pray for you and get saved just if you are. God bless you. 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 Just lift your hand and I, I, God bless you. Just stand up right now. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. When you have lifted up your hands, stand up. When you raised up your hands, stand up. Whoever raised up your hand, stand up. And those behind, lift up your hands so that I may see you. Praise the Lord. Listen. My hands, when I got saved, God told me, whoever you lay your hand upon, you will be blessed. Come, let me bless you with my hands. Come, let me bless you. Come, let me bless you. Woo! Quickly come and pastor will bless you. You are warmly welcome. You are welcome. You are welcome. Don't go back, you are welcome. Welcome. Quickly, please run. The pastor wants to bless you. You are welcome. You are welcome. You are welcome. Please go to the right hand. Clap. 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 Godinga sikuli ama duke misinde eno Kati kwa sika dobu jabu kute kubanga Oganyino kube engalu wama sanyu sokula ba God bless you Sembe eno, sembe eno Sembe eno, sembe eno Kalibu, kalibu, kalibu Kalibu, kalibu, kalibu Kalibu, kalibu Kalibu, kalibu, kalibu Kalibu, kalibu, kalibu Sanyu sokula ba Jangu, 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 jangu eno Kuli ajayi nomu kwa takomu ngalu Lord, when you come, the pastor wants to bless you Sanyu sokula ba You are welcome Sanyu sokula ba You are welcome there are those who are still there. Don't miss this blessing. Quickly run forward. Come forward, I'm waiting for you. We are waiting for you. God is rich in mercy. Don't miss this blessing. Quickly run, run forward. You are welcome. God saves. God bless you. Very quickly, quickly come forward. They are coming. More people are coming. Two, three people are coming now. Quickly come forward. We are waiting for you. We shall wait for you. Those who want to be born again, come forward. Come and I bless you. Thank you for accepting Jesus. Thank you for accepting Jesus. God bless you. Yes, amen. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Ngenda kusaba. I'm going to pray. Wadi abasika de unga mutu de. Some are remain seated. Mugambo bangende. You are asking, should I go? Obasigenda. Oh, I don't go. Obatata na nyika. Oh, my father be angry at me. Oh, what will my husband do to me? Let me tell you something. Every person that you fear, they will never be buried with you. And let me tell you, you try to die and see. They will cry for two minutes and then we shall leave you there buried down. After burying you wake up and look out for them you will not see anyone there. 
kati we yambe yambe we kaduka ojoro koke osoboro genda mu bakaba kabwa katonda help yourself quickly run forward and receive the kingdom of god oloko zibuwo we kasi bwa tata osi bwa mama osi bwa muchala osi bwa mwami wo salvation is only yours it is not for your husband not for your father not for your wife duke emisinde we gate kubanno quickly run come join your fellows now zibiriza amasoko close your eyes take me kono jo mu chifuba let your hands at your chest Say Lord Jesus Today I have decided To be born again Thank you Jesus For saving me I thank you that my life has come to the book of life. Now I'm living. I'm going to heaven. My life is changing today. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for saving me. Amen. Amen. Stretch out your hands, let's pray for the people. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray for all your children. Fill them with your Holy Spirit. So that they may speak new languages. They know how to pray. Be established in salvation. Be women and great men. In the name of our Son of the Living God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Now, even if I don't have supper, God has done a miracle. You see those chairs here? They're prepared for you. You go sit there. We are going to pray with you at the end of the service. You are the first people to have lunch. The lunch is served first to these people. Praise the Lord. You just go and have your seat. That man behind you, that is an engineer. Let him direct you where to sit. If you left behind your belongings, you go pick your bag and come back here. Amen. Praise the Lord. In this church, we love visitors. How many is your first time to come and you a visitor? Lift up your hand. It is your first time to come, lift up your hand and wave to us. You visited us, you were somewhere a visitor. All visitors, you are welcome. Visitors also stand up. Visitors also stand up. If your first time to come, all visitors who are there, give God a mighty hand clap. <laughs> Our visitors, Ashes, Abakebes, Mukolewa Nechaman, do something here. I'm going to pray for the visitors. Mujemba Kwata Komunga, Jangun and Sawoyo, come with your bag. I'm going to pray for our visitors. Don't leave anything, your show, Mukanya Fijangu, and your belonging, come with them. Our visitors in the name of our Lord Jesus. Our visitors come and God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Our visitors come forward, come forward. You welcome. You welcome. You welcome. Our visitors are welcome. Our visitors are welcome. Our visitors are welcome. Our visitors are welcome. Amen. Sang so kubala ba abageni ba fe. Abageni muangwe ko muangwe ko ba asha mutiyambe wano. Kwa sana ba kubuza ko jangungo ni mugeni. Sang so kubala ba musembere mase no musembere mase no ni no ba ko ata kumugal. Sang so kubala ba abageni abageni muluwa muluwa abageni muche muche muche. 
Gwe sinabuza ko jangu 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 enu Sanyu sokula ba Sanyu sokula ba Aba kenyi duke emisinde duke emisinde kari Quickly come forward Kimbia kimbia wagenyi mugenyi kuja apa mugenyi apa Our visitors kalibu sana Wagenyi sanyu sokubala ba You welcome Haa Sanyu sokubala ba You welcome Aba kenyi bachaja Are we still receiving visitors? Aha Gole mikono jotu sabiraba kenyi bafe Stretch out your hands and we pray for our visitors Tata mulinye via yesu Father in Jesus name Tukwe basoro aba kenyi bafe We thank you for our visitors Tuba sabire chisacho We will speak your grace upon them Nekaba kula kula ne Let them prosper Nekaba gagawale Let them be rich Nekaba gare katonda Let them love God Nekaba bereba amai Let them be strong Mulinye via yesu In the name of Holy Jesus Christ Amen Amina Kati aba kenyi bafe temuta yeri Our visitors don't go back Buno butebo bulunji wa mwe These chairs are yours after those who are serving food, our visitors so also come fast. But Asha Zimu, because they're speedy, Asha Zimu, nobody could do to what only nobody was feeding, nobody was evangelizing, nobody was watching. Yamba kwa no, yamba kwa no. Let's all support and see that our visitors are catered for. In the name of Allah Jesus. Mkasera kano. At this time, kwate chwe wa yochi. Get hold of your offering. If you didn't receive an envelope, lift your hand and receive one. Get hold of that good offering. Get hold of that offering. A very good offering. Ashes, please help us. Please help us with envelopes. I need one. Amen. Amina. For you are great. You do miracles so great. There is no one else like you. For you are great. You do miracles so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one like you. For you are great. For you are great. You do miracles so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great. You do miracles so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. To Saba, we are praying. Our good Father, you change our languages. I pray for everybody who is giving in. May May the blessing that you promised that enriches be upon them. They will receive money. Much money. Father, let their income increase. Those with poultry, bless them. Those who farm, Lord, bless their farms. Those in the government office. Let their salaries be increased. Let there be joy in their pockets. Let whatever they lay their hand upon be blessed. Border border riders, bless them and let them buy new ones. Those who work in markets, Lord, bless them. Those in public offices and different places, bless them. 
bless them. Those who are watching us online, receiving us from upload, bless their works. Father, I pray that ours didn't go out to do slavery. Our people went to make some good money. I refuse the language of slavery. They went to make money. You promised a blessing in the city and in the country. Blessing in the Uganda and outside it, Lord. I bless even those who want to go abroad, Father, bless them. Those who want to work from abroad, Lord, bless their passports and they receive visas and they go. Those who are planning, let, them, let everything go through well. In the name of our Jesus Christ. Amen. Amina. Listen. We have two things that we are going to do. You are going to come and give and go back to your place. We are going to use 10 minutes only. After you giving in your offering, then lineages will pass before the Lord. Let our visitors give first. After them giving, they'll go back to their seats. Those who are working on the uh, next service outside, please know the visitors are coming fast. Get their tent. Come and give, and then you go back to your seat. Amen. Things are already better. Things are already better. When the Lord is on the throne